Yeah, so the relationship really developed. We had a, when I was at the Rabbitohs, we had a training camp up at Coffs Harbour, and every year we'd go up there and uh, we got asked to do work in the community. So ETC at the time were doing a fair bit of amount, a fair amount of work, particularly with the Indigenous community, and that was a nice fit for, for our guys, so we, it sort of developed from there. Then we started talking about, well, what can we get also out of it, you know, in terms of training and that, and the conversation really started from there, and that's uh, some seven years ago, I think. Training's been unbelievable. Um, started off in, in a group atmosphere with all the boys at footy. Um, I retired at the end of, the end of last season, and uh, Rachel's been fantastic. She's been making the effort to come out here sort of once a week, um, still taking me through it. So, you know, they've really been there to support me the whole way. I've just left the Rabbitohs, um, but uh, prior to leaving, I had some staff and myself that were doing the uh, workplace assessor and trainer. We were uh, getting that accreditation because we were do doing an uh, Indigenous Schools to Work program, so it was an opportunity for us to upskill ourselves in delivering training packages. And for the playing group, I'd uh, started meeting with some of the players, the more senior players, and it came through a strong theme that they wanted to look at a small business um, program. So it spoke to ETC and uh, it really started from there. Yeah, I've really enjoyed it. It's, um, for me it was, it was a, l a less formal sort of thing where you know, I could sit down, I could just have a chat with Rachel about different things and uh, I actually enjoyed every session that I attended. So yeah, I, I just found that there wasn't a punish to go to. Where with other courses I've done, you, know, you, you dread doing them where this I'm really looking forward to it because the stuff I've been able to learn, I've been able to relate it straight to my business and uh, implement them straight away. I suppose the point of difference uh, with ETC really is the fact that uh, they can uh, deliver what they say they can um, and cost effective as well. A lot of the more traditional and bigger organisations say they can be flexible and that they can be at a cost, whereas uh, ETC being a smaller organisation I think are able to respond to the needs of the uh, employer group or the, the group that is requiring training and um, being able to deliver what their, to their needs specifically. I definitely think it's given me a leg up. Um, obviously I'm, I'm still learning as I go, but uh, if I have any questions and I need help with anything, I'll just give Rachel a call straight away and she helps me out. So yeah, it's been fantastic. Uh, without having her, it would definitely have been a lot harder.